Hello again, everybody. Indiana's New Albany High School was opened back in the year 1853, eight years before the U.S. Civil War began. It is the home of WNAS Radio, the first radio station in the United States owned and operated by a high school. Famous people connected to the school include Fuzzy Zeller, a two-time major champion in golf, plus Sherman Minton, who became a U.S. Supreme Court justice, and Edwin Hubble, who had a top U.S. space telescope named after him. New Albany has 15 senior spring student athletes, so it was hit hard by the pandemic shutdown. In a video provided by the school, you see some of their faces and names. Their athletic director is B.J. McAllister. You know, Fred, uh, I, I don't know if we, you ever really, if we ever really knew exactly what path we were going down. You know, it was just, you know, crazy times, unprecedented, so... You know, I think kids were all just like us. You know, some days we were better than others, and some days uh, you were like, man, you know, I just, I, I just need something. McAllister oversees New Albany's six spring sports. Expectations were high, and boys and girls track, coming off successful seasons. But no happy endings in 2020. So we spotlight them here and wish them safe travels and the next steps in their life journeys. New Albany is always your home. You know, you were, you're just because your senior year ended like it did, uh, you're always welcome back here. People always say, and have said well before me, yeah, once a Bulldog, always a Bulldog. And we want to make sure that our alumni uh, uh, remember that and, and are proud of that. To see all the names of the New Albany Bulldogs, seniors, spring student, athletes, just go to WLKY.com and click on sports. I am Fred Cowgill, WLKY Sports.